What is good, what is poppin' everybody? It's your boy, Vari, the truth himself, Mr. No Cap. And we are back with another video. And this time, it is a vlog for my second visit to Durban for a shoot. Now, obviously, you gotta start, like, you gotta start right if you're gonna do something like that. And modeling is all about, like, confidence, looks. And I had to start by the gym to make sure that my mindset and the body is ready to take on the day. So obviously I got the lineup after, but I had to freshen up, you know, take a bath, get ready because I had a flight uh, for the day before the shoot. And uh, yeah, so I was getting ready to catch my flight. So I had to get my time right um, so that I don't be late and miss my flight. Um, obviously, if you're going to do this modeling thing professionally, you got to have like a model bag ready. And this is me preparing one, you know, getting my clothes um, since I'm flying to a different city. Um, I had to make sure I have everything I need um, in, in arm's reach, you know, uh, making sure that my toiletries are packed, making sure that my clothes and everything is packed. And uh, yeah, after that, it was a haircut and we were off to the flight. Now, we're talking about Johannesburg here and the, the traffic is crazy, especially when you get late on in the day. So I had to make sure that I don't miss my flight. I took off pretty early, like an hour before so I can get there an hour before my my flight so yeah made it on time fortunately and uh yeah it was a later on flight i caught it at seven seven at night so yeah as you can see we're starting to get dark um and obviously this is one of my favorite parts like just the city views got to durban safe this is me arriving in durban and for the convenience of my shoot the client booked me at like a suncoast um hotel So this is me arriving at the hotel. Hotel is beautiful. This is the lobby. Entrance to the lobby. Entrance to the reception. So, yeah. Had to get myself a Kimbo, honestly. Like, these, these freehand shots are pretty difficult to get, but... The city view at night. Obviously stunning. This is Derby. Uh... Yeah. Made it. Lights on. Had to check the place out. Nice bright lights. Beautiful beige and white colors. Um, this is the boy. <laughs> pretty much matching the place so let's get a feel of the bed make sure that it's all comfortable you know check the chair out even though I'm definitely not going to use it but you know, I figured since I was going to have dinner I might try it out and uh, yeah I had to check out the, you know, the throne, the bathroom, make sure that everything's straight, everything's clean, and it was clean, it smelled great, place was fresh, uh, there's a shower, because of course, you know, I'm going to get ready in the AM, so I got to make sure everything is in tip-top shape. And of course, what is staying in a hotel without room service? <laughs> I had to order from a vast menu that they had. Um, food arrived on time. I was super hungry from a flight, and this is what I had for dinner. And it was rice and bean stew with uh, dessert, which was uh, brownies. Look at me looking all cool. Like I didn't actually devour that whole thing. I made sure that everything in their plate disappeared. And before you know it, it was 5 a.m. Watched a bit of a movie, but uh, didn't even finish it. I had to make sure I get enough rest because I was up early. Um, I had to get up early, ask the guys in the hotel to give me a wake-up call. He was ready. 
to take on the day. <laughs> had to get a nice view of the, the ocean but you know unfortunately because of the, how the week was the weather was quite gloomy you know, so i couldn't get like the nice sunrise shot that i was looking forward to but uh, i was happy i'm home i was home at that time so yeah, yeah. back to business lights on time to get ready for my shoot so. Never really shot without the flex. Let's jump in the shower, get ready, jump out. Simple outfit, you know, because um, I wasn't really, it wasn't about my fit really. I'm, I'm, on, I'm on my way to work to fit other people's uh, stuff, <laughs> you know. So after getting ready, I was out, headed straight to the lobby so that I meet up with the other models. One final checkup and it was still gloomy, so <laughs> had my breakfast packed, it was a quite a nice, you know, healthy breakfast. Had to eat something, make sure that you know um, I eat the most important meal of the day. The chauffeur had arrived, linked up with other models, you know, they were you know pretty cool people. Uh, we were all here for the same shoot, so we had to take off the same time. My shoot was later on in the day, but I had to just like take off so that it's, it's easier for me to be reached instead of just being collected later. So, yeah. And we were off. Just like that, um, you know. Even though the weather was gloomy, um, my city is still beautiful. Like it was lovely seeing the palm trees again, breathing the air. Like the coastal air is just different. Like the air in Johannesburg is like super dry, so it was nice. It, it, it just felt natural. It felt great to be home. Uh, just drove around the city towards the location where we were shooting at, which wasn't so far from you know where we were staying at. And this most Mobile Stadium, for those who haven't visited Durban and don't know. As you can see, we're not too far from where we're staying at. Like, I can still see the hotel from where we were shooting at the location. But, um, yeah, we made it there on time and everybody was ready to go. And this was me getting my makeup done before changing up to clothes. I couldn't get a lot of shots because obviously we're talking about exclusives here. Like, so, so I probably had to post this like maybe next year, Jan. And I wasn't about that life. The team was super nice, super energetic, and I was excited. And uh, yeah, my shoot was not at that location. It was in another location. So yeah. An angel is crazy work. We move though. Guys, we just finished doing a shoot that has been long awaited, but we killed it. Um, worked with great people, and but, yeah, peace out. I'm about to finish off, take off my flight to Johannesburg, man. It's been great to be in Durban, and uh, yeah, see you guys on the next one. <laughs> In no time we was done with the shoots then uh, we had to head back to the location to fetch the other models and take off for the flight.
the airport made it in record time actually three hours worth of record time we had to wait long for the flight but i guess better safe than sorry couldn't miss the flight chauffeur had to do his job and be done with his day so we got there pretty early chilled a bit and as you can see um we, we stayed there till like got dark all laptops and notebooks must be stowed away safe. and again it's my favorite part the takeoff we we'll get to see the you know, city lights the views i even mentioned this on stardust man like i'm crazy about stars man and um if i'm at a high point at night the city lights always look like you know stars a bit closer so it's really nice great views i mean just look at that made it safe to Johannesburg you know um, and this was me in an Uber back to my place and I mean the weather's quite gloomy in Joburg so one would assume that uh, it should be better there but guess what it was also raining but uh, hey <laughs> made it safe got back to my place I'm super tired and this was the two day vlog of me being a model so hope you guys enjoyed it and catch you on the next one peace out Yeah.